Hey guys, what is up? It's me, Matt Clark here again, and today we are going to be talking about mostly sports news, but um, a lot, but a lot of other news too. Um, but so um, to start to start off, um, is that first of all, it's been exactly a year ago today, the Toronto uh, Raptors, uh. Well, the Ka- well, Kawhi Leonard and Danny Green signed with um, the two LA teams a year ago today, which shocked all uh, Toronto fans, which and made them kind of a little not happy. Um, I mean, I I I I was kind of okay with it because, like you know, it was like I guess like I knew that like even if they um even if they didn't sign with the Raptors, Toronto still had a chance, so I was kind of okay with it. As well, today the MLB um, gave out its schedule about all kinds of different things, from, uh, about a lot of different things that were all uh, happen. That uh, their schedule they've given out. As well, the NHL has given out um, the fact that they are going to be returning to play uh, on August first, which is pretty close from now. Um. You know, all of this news together makes me pretty hyped up because sports is coming back and we need them to come back because it's getting really boring. Um, as well, apparently, um, um, PI, Prince Edward Island, has gotten five cases within the past few days, which apparently is a lot to them. Wait, I got something on my hat. Which is apparently a lot to the island because they don't really get that many incomers. Uh, also, I forgot to add this. The Toronto Blue Jays uh, have just returned to Toronto today. So they're back in Toronto and they will be um, training in Toronto now. Uh, yeah. As well, um, as I said, PEI had five more. But one thing that was, that's good is that there's only there were only eight new cases in China and zero cases in Beijing in the past few days. So that's good. Um you know, at least we didn't, at least we don't, you know, um, get any more cases, so we're, ca- it's kind of dying down, hopefully, hopefully it'll be good, as, as I always, as I said, like, um, to one of my friends, I forgot if I've said it here or not, for me, uh, as someone who believes in everything, who, like, you know, believes in everything, like, aliens and stuff, I believe that we would be able to, I mean, I believe that th- it's got to be a fair year where it's like half of it, it's kind of bad, while the second half is actually amazing. So I'd say like Tron. So I would say like uh like uh on our second half of the year, we would have a way better year, like the best year in the history for the second half. Um, like so good that we we would forget about the first half, as um you know. Um, it's already happening as everything's come starting to come back to normal. Uh, as well, our water park beside us, of course, as I said yesterday, opened up and there's like a million people there. As well, today was the first day of my debate camp and I was kind of, it was kind of okay. Not as bad as I thought, although it takes up half of my day. Um, and, and I guess, uh, like, also, another news is that, like, a bunch of people are selling houses now because they feel like either at the house, because they feel like the housing price is actually good enough now, so they should sell it. As well, it's probably because it's graduation time, so once the people graduate, they would just sell it because most people uh, live in the house, big houses, because it, because of their, um, child, or, um, uh, going to school, so... Uh, you know, that would, that is mostly the case. So, yeah. Um, hopefully you guys liked it and peace.